these are Langy Box's most watched challenge videos on YouTube. From Guess the Emoji challenges that got 5 million views to impossible challenge videos that got 10 billion views, you'll be able to complete all the challenges in this video. Stick around because if you can solve the riddle at the end of this video, it actually reveals a leaked Poppy Playtime huge secret. Let's, Let's go. go. Today we're seeing if we can beat this Guess the Emoji game. Okay, now what's this? Guess the fast food place by emoji. Oh, I'm gonna be a pro at this, dude. Oh, let's see. Okay, we gotta guess before the timer runs out. Easy, bro. Here's the first one. All right. What? Guess the fast food place. Well, how am I supposed to guess this? Is it anywhere we go? <laughs> <laughs> We're some clowns. <laughs> yeah, yeah. This is pretty okay, tricky. Okay, let me think, dude. Is burgers, fries. Okay, most fast food places have that. But a clown. This gotta be McDonald's, bro. Oh, I think you're right, because Ronald McDonald's a clown. It's McDonald's! Let's go! Okay, now we got pizza, and then we got, like, an acorn or something. I think it's, like, a house. What? That's, pizza that's house. a house? You have that emoji on your phone? <laughs> I don't the know. The house emoji looks totally different. Put the house emoji on the screen. If you want to put a house, it'd be different. Yeah, this one is really tricky. Pizza. Pizza nut. <laughs> Justin's a pizza nut because he goes nuts for pizza. Yeah! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> so stick sharp! <laughs> yeah! yeah! <laughs> now, guys, play along. These are going to get harder and harder. We got food, animals, Sonic, and Kanto, a bunch of emojis. It's not pizza nut. It's pizza hut. It's a hut! Oh! A hut! It's pizza hut! Let's go! Let's go! Nice! Okay, now this one is like a grandpa. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe this is like you in like 50 years. When you're like an old man. And I own a Tilka <laughs> restaurant. <laughs> this is my restaurant. It's called Justy Tilka. <laughs> yep, that's the I've locked that in. I am mm. working on opening a Tilka restaurant. And it's going to be lit. Well, which fast food place has chicken that you love to go to? Uh, uh. You uh, got it. Popeyes. Mm. Popeyes, and this like a grandpa. <laughs> Papa. Uh, Papa. -pa. <laughs> what other chicken fast food places do you love to go that rhyme with may meth me? What? You still don't know? I think I know the answer to this one. Colonel Sanders? That's <laughs> KFC! <laughs> Woo! Easy. Yup, yeah, let's go. Let's go. Hey, right, this one's easy, bro. Wow! It's Taco Bell! Yeah! Yeah, but don't worry, guys. There's some super tricky ones in here. You got that one. Taco Bell. Oh, man. This one's easy, too, bro. <laughs> Hamburger Crown? Sandwich Crown. Sam That's not a fast food place. Yeah, it is. Sandwich Crown? Yeah. Oh, I never heard of it. I go there all the time. Oh. Man, Foxy owns that store. Oh, cool. She puts on a little crown and she says, may I take your order? But wait, 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 wait. Isn't that a burger, not a sandwich? It's a hamburger. It's a cheeseburger, to be more exact. It's cheese. Cheeseburger crown. Cheeseburger king. Burger king! Oh! Woo! Easy. Okay, now this one is very difficult. What? Star money? Star dollars. What is this? Gold star dollar bill. What is, wait, what is this? I actually don't know. Maybe I never ate at this restaurant. <clears throat> um, huh? Guys, please play along. These are gonna get harder and harder. We're, we're kind of stumped. Dude! What? It's Starbucks! Oh! That was so difficult! Okay, so we have basketball a basketball player. Donut, basketball donut, basketball donut. When I'm on the basketball court, I dunk on Adam. <laughs> Dunkin' Donuts! Oh, that one was good. Wow, these are gonna get more and more difficult. I can already tell. What is this, bro? Hmm. What is dice pizza? Pizza dice, pizza roll. Wait a minute. What? You like your ordering Domino's pizza, right? Yeah, that's not a Domino, that's a dice. Yeah, but Domino's have the numbers on it. But that's not a Domino. Hmm, so maybe it's not Domino's then, you're saying. The, the, it's the, not Domino's. Uh, let me let me figure it out. All right, you got it. Dice rhymes with slice, and I want a slice of pizza. And when I want a slice of pizza, I order from Domino's. It's Domino's. <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> okay, now this one is super tricky, guys. What is this? Down up burger. Arrow arrow burger. Arrow arrow. What is this emoji? Mailbox? Mail mail burger? In up burger. <laughs> in and out burger. Oh, in and out. It's in and out burger. What is this, bro? 
<laughs> you should get this one. Milk princess. Okay, that's what you call your body. Right? <laughs> <laughs> so, I have another glass of milk. <laughs> milk girl. Cow lady. Cow woman. <laughs> <laughs> what are we just doing? What are we doing here? I don't know. I'm trying to figure just it out. Just all your nicknames for your mom. <laughs> Show some respect, Adam. What? I know what it is. What? What's another word for milk? Dairy? Dairy queen. Dairy queen. Dairy queen, bro. What wow. Is, one of Adam's favorite restaurants ever. How could you not think of that, Adam? I love Dairy Queen. Let's go. Oh, I got this one, dude. What is it? Choo-choo. It's a train. Choo-choo sandwich. Choo-choo's your sandwich. Choose what you want on your sandwich, and you can do that at Subway, which is what this is, Subway Sandwich. Oh, Subway. Subway Sandwich. Okay, now what is this, bro? We got Panda. Panda. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, well, I only know one fast food place that has Panda in it, and that's Panda <laughs> Express. Panda Express, what is this, bro? I guess that's an express. I don't even understand. Like an express train. Oh, that's a train? I thought that was a shark. Okay, now this one's hard. What is this? Hand family. Hand guys. Hand five guys. Oh. Five guys, bro. Now we have to guess the Encanto character based on the emoji. Bruh. Okay, there's a door and these glasses. These green glasses only belong to one person, bro. <laughs> Mirabelle from Encanto. Oh, it's Mirabelle. And we got the magic door. Is it Mirabelle, dude? Yes, let's go. Okay, well, this from Encanto also, and the flower, the flower power is Isabel, bro. Oh, it's got to be Isabel. I don't think so. Let's go. Isabella, dude. Let's go. Easy. All right, guys. Here's the next one. This, this one's, one's tricky. tricky. This one's real tricky, man. Mm, it could be Bruno. What? Because <laughs> the green eyes, like the green birdie. Stop! Right, 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 right. I don't think it is. This, mm. this parrot reminds me of one character, one character only. You know who I'm thinking of, Adam? Who? <laughs> oh, Captain Jack Sparrow? What? Wrong movie. No. Uh, Not Pirates of the Caribbean. No. Who is this? Toucan Sam? No. Mm. I'm stumped, guys. I don't know this one. You don't know the character from a Kanto with the green toucan? Well, well, well. <laughs> it's obviously Antonio. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> okay, got the donkey. Donkey! But it's not Shrek, so I'm not gonna guess Shrek. This is from Encanto. Hmm. Donkey! Well, they do have the muscle arms. Muscles. Hmm. Muscles. Could be, if this was Shrek, it would be Princess Fiona. She's very strong. Right. But it's not Shrek. But if it's from Encanto, it's probably, probably Louisa. I would agree. I would agree, guys. Lock in your answer now. Let's go! Oh, man, now this one is tricky. Okay, then we have the listen, and then we have the bow. Mm. Bro, we don't talk about Bruno. Bo, bo. Oh, it's Bruno! I'm gonna lock in Bruno. Yeah! I mean, what do you think it is, bro? I think you got it. I think it's Bruno. We don't talk about Bruno. Oh, it was Dolores! How did I not see the bow? <laughs> <laughs> okay, now we gotta guess the animal, and here we have a cake fish. Hmm. I'm gonna guess Nemo. What animal is this? Could be thick shark. He loves eating cake. I think that might be Jello. Jello fish. Jellyfish. Oh! Wow, we got it. That was confusing because honestly, I was thinking of a fish, and a jellyfish doesn't even look like that. Let's go. Okay, now these are getting very tricky, bro. Okay, guys, play along. Each of these emojis is gonna equal an animal. What is this, dude? We're running out of time already. I have no idea. E plus leaf mm -hmm. plus bug. E okay. leaf bug. E leaf bug. <laughs> E leaf, a leaf bug, e leaf bug, a leaf bug. E an ant? Is that an ant? I think it's an ant. E leaf ant. <gasps> e leaf ant. E plus leaf plus ant. What does that spell, guys? E leaf ant. 
It's elephant! <laughs> guys, that was tricky. These are getting very tricky, guys. Elephant. I get it. You have to, like, kind of sound it out. Today, we are seeing if we can beat this extreme zoomed-in challenge. Okay, now we have to guess what we're looking at. It's a zoomed-in photo. What is that? What is that, like a heart? Oh, it might be like a character. Wait, wait, no, no, no. What is the thing in the middle? Is oh, no. Heart? Guys, play along with us. See if you can figure out what these zoomed-in pictures are. I think this is like Mickey Mouse, dude. Oh, but is those like Mickey Mouse teeth? Yeah, I bet it's like corrupt Mickey. Or is this... Wait, if that's a mouth... Then the, the, the character must be, like, yellow? Because you see the yellow on the corner? I don't know, dude. Who do you think it is? I think it's Spongebob. Okay. Wait, it actually made sense when you said the character is yellow. Yeah. But I feel like I I recognize that big tooth up top. Yeah, Spongebob. No, I think it reminds me of Bunzo Bunny. Wait, it, I think it is Bunzo because it, Bunzo has those sharp teeth like that. Exactly. Let's see if that's right. It was Bunzo Bunny. All right. Let's know if you guys got that one at home. <laughs> <laughs> wait, who's that? What are we looking at, dude? Who is that? Oh, wait a minute. I think this might be, um, Baldy. What? Because I think that's what Baldy looks like up close. Dude, you're actually right. Wait, what else? Who else could this be? Are we looking at it upside down? What is this, bro? Oh, maybe. I think, um, this could actually be Squidward. Oh, well, yeah, maybe. But the, the color of Squidward is blue. What? Like, doesn't Squidward, he's, isn't he he's blue? He's green. Mm, okay. I think it might be, um, Gru from Despicable Me, the bald guy. Dude, with like a cartoon Gru, wait a minute. Gru made me think of Poo, Evil Poo. No way. That's Evil Poo. It is, yeah. <laughs> okay, now who is this? Wait, what are we even looking at, dude? Wow, this one looks tricky. Okay, if you guys get this one, you're an actual genius. What are we looking at here? Is that like a cloud in the sky? Um, I don't know. Maybe that's like a tail on the bottom. What? A t what? Guys, play along. See if you can actually figure this out before Justin and I do. Okay, hold on. We're looking at a blue. These are all characters. There's a blue character. I bet it's Dory from Finding Nemo. Oh, that would make sense. She is blue. Just keep swimming. Just keep swimming. <laughs> I think it's Dory, bro. I'm going to lock in um, Sonic. <laughs> Dude, I didn't even think of Sonic. Yeah, guys, I think I got it right. Okay, okay, let's see what this is. <laughs> oh! It was Catboy. It was like the logo behind Catboy. Oh, I see that every time he transforms. Yeah. Oh, that was max difficulty. Did any of you guys get that? Oh, what is this? Okay, that definitely looks like a mouth. Yeah, it's some teeth and like a tongue. But who has a tongue like that? Um, I don't know. It's got to be a blue. I think it's Adam. No, that's not me. Yeah, dude, yeah, I think it's Adam because he dressed up as a clown um last year for Halloween. I think it's you. No, it's not me, Stick guys. Out your Let's see if it looks. Like <laughs> that's it. Yeah. No, oh, come on. <laughs> it's not me. I think it's you, dude. Do it so I can make sure. What are you doing? I don't know. <laughs> Wait a minute. I think I might know who this is. What? I think this might be Bluey because he's a blue dog. I think it's uh, Blue's Clues. Oh, that! Oh, oh I should have guessed that. I think you got that, that blues right. Clues, dude. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> Blue's Clues makes a lot of sense. Is it, or it might be Clifford. Well, Clifford's red. I don't think it's Clifford. Okay, it, it's either Blue's Clues or Bluey. Or, um, I was gonna say it could be someone from Paw Patrol, but I don't think it is. It's a dog. It's definitely a dog. Yeah, I'm gonna say I think I was right with Bluey. Okay, I'm gonna lock in um talking Angela. Okay, good idea. It might be talking Angela. It's PJ Pugapel. Oh, man. What? Okay, now what is that? Okay. Oh, I, I know immediately what this is. What? This is a um, pea shooter from uh, Plants vs. Zombies. Oh, right, guys. It's the plant from Plants vs. Zombies that shoots the peas. That's the mouth. Right, that's it. I got it, right? I think so, it's yeah. It's like a 3D pea shooter. That's awesome. I can't believe you got it that fast. Dude, it's because I play a lot of Plants vs. Zombies. Do you have a different guess? Um, okay, well, I'm not gonna steal Justin's guess, yeah. even though I think he's right. Yeah. So I'm just gonna randomly guess a character that's green. Okay. I'm gonna guess Shrek. <laughs> Shrek doesn't look like that. Yeah, I don't know, but I just wanted to, like, guess. Okay. I don't know. Okay, Adam, here we go. <gasps> what? Oh, I actually got it right! <laughs> it was his ears. I forgot what Shrek's ears looked like. Did you guys get that one? What? Okay, now this is max difficulty. What are we even looking at, dude? This is a crazy zoomed in challenge. If any of you guys get these, you're a genius because 99% of people failed this quiz. That's true, guys. 99%. So you're literally in the top 1% smartest people if you know what, it. What is this? What am I looking at? Like a sun? Like, is that like a planet? 
I don't know if it's a planet. I think it might be an eyeball. No, oh, an eyeball. But wait, it's like a purple eyeball. Who has purple eyes? Okay, that's a big hint. It's a purple eyeball. Um, I have no idea. I'm trying to think of like purple characters. Cast and Master, Mommy Long Legs. No. Um, uh, she has green eyes. But wait, guys, we got another hint. The, the area around the eyes is not like it's not pink it's like brown that's a big hint so maybe it's like talking ben it's like a brown character with pink eyes hmm with pink eyes character with pink eyes wait a minute foxy says is it me uh it could be foxy it could be foxy kind of looks like that yeah foxy's cuter though mm. Mm. i think guys this is just a random guess i'm gonna lock in Tails from, nah, from Sonic. I know who this is. Dude, I, I, I was thinking Amy from Sonic for a second, but I actually know who it is because I, I watch so much Paw Patrol, dude. Wait, this is a Paw Patrol character? That's Sky, bro. That's Sky's eyes, bro. No way. Is it actually Sky? I'm pretty sure that's Sky. No way. Are you ready? Yeah. Yeah! Wow! How did you know that? I watch so much Paw Patrol! <laughs> Let's go! Okay, now what are we looking at here? Is that a face? It's a snake, dude. It's a snake. Oh, right. I think it is a snake. You can kind of see like the scales. Yeah, or, is, or it could be a fish. Okay, who could this be? I think this is um the um um I think it's Harry Potter. Oh, Harry Potter. That's a good guess. It's yeah. Sly Slytherin. Right. Right. Or I the basilisk. Oh, I actually think this is Monty Gator because I think he has gator skin. Dude, I think you're right. Actually, this is like scales and it looks like some sort of reptile on the front, right? Yeah. Yeah, guys, do you recognize this anywhere? What is this? Wait, what is this, guys? It's something about it is so familiar, but I don't know what it is. It's a green um, character. Are there green characters? <gasps> I got it! I got it! I was gonna lock in Montigator. I'm gonna lock in um the crocodile from Sonic. Oh, that's a good guess. Bro, yeah. Easy, right? Easy. I was gonna guess Shrek again, but I think Monty Gator's right. You just really like Shrek, huh? I think it's Monty Gator. Okay! <laughs> I'm gonna go with the green crocodile from Sonic. All right, let's see if you're right. Let's go. <laughs> oh, you're kidding. I should have known that one. Adam loves Gecko. Man. I don't think he is Gecko, dude. Yeah. Are you serious? Okay, now once again, I have no idea what we're looking at. This is one of the hardest zoomed in challenges we've ever seen in our lives. Oh, man. Okay, I think this is hair, but it could be anyone. No, like, dude, I think this is Sonic. Really? Yeah, because it's blue and dark blue. See, it's Sonic. Oh, Sonic, that would make sense. I think we're looking at a Sonic here. What do you think? I think it's, um, Ryder. It might be me. It might be me. Look. Wait, that actually looks identical to Justin. I think it's me, bro. It's like an animated Justin. I think it's me, bro. Wow. No, I think it's Sonic. Is this Sonic or is it my hair? Who else has blue hair? Um, Who has blue hair, dude? Boyfriend from Friday Night Funkin'. Yeah. But uh, that's all I can think of. Who else has blue hair? Blue hair, blue hair. Blue hair, blue hair. It might be Huggy Wuggy. I don't think it's Huggy Wuggy. It's not the right shade of blue. What? I really do think it's Justin. You think it's me? I'm gonna lock in Justin as my answer, yeah. It does kind of match though, huh? Mm-hmm. I'm gonna stick with my gut, which is Sonic. Okay, okay, okay let's that's go. a good guess. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> it was Miraculous Ladybug! Oh, boy, that's embarrassing. We are so dumb, dude. How do we not get that? Come on! <laughs> oh, man, what are we looking at here? Mm, this does look like a mouth and a nose. If I go upside down, I can see it better. Really? Um, all the blood rushing to my head. <laughs> I don't see. Wait, what are we looking at? It's a mouth? Oh, okay, yeah. And I guess what are those lines? Like whiskers? And they might be whiskers, yeah. So it might be like a tiger or um, um. Oh, I was gonna say it's Roxanne Wolf. Oh, Roxanne Wolf. That's a really or good like guess. Or like Chica, because that's like Chica's colors, like white and pink. Right, guys. Yeah, I think it might be Chica. But Chica doesn't have fur. This looks like fur. Who has fur that looks like this, though? I actually don't know. Wait, wh why are these so difficult today? My brain... It's like exploding, dude. I like can't get it. I'm going to go ahead and go for just a crazy guess. I'm going to guess Ghosty. Is it Ghosty? Yeah, I was just thinking it's Ghosty. Because Ghosty's cheeks are pink, kind of like the pink in this picture. And she also glows in the dark. Well, you can see Ghosty right here. Does it look the same? <laughs> Yeah, kind of. Are you serious, Adam? Yeah, Ghosty's lit. You really can't tell it's not me, Adam. 
It's not you? Ghosty says, what do you, what do you think? Look at Ghosty. <laughs> not the same. Ghosty's awesome, guys. Ghosty is awesome, but I don't think that's Ghosty, man. Wait, we have to get this one, dude. Hmm. What kind of character is this, man? Detective Ghosty's on the case. Okay, guys. Ghosty, what do you see? Ghosty says, oh, something real scary at 3 a.m. Huh? <laughs> something scary at 3 a.m. Wait a minute. That, that, like, got it in my head. I think it's talking to Angela. That, yes, dude. That is 100% talking to Angela, actually. It was! Wow, thanks, Ghosty. Let's go, dude. Okay, now, what are we looking at here? Now, it looks like some sort of glove, like my cool Spider-Man gloves. It's some sort of glove. I think it's Mickey Mouse, dude, right? He, Mickey Mouse has, like, gloves like that. Right, he does have gloves like that. Yeah, that who makes else, sense. Who else has gloves or hands like that? Although, it looks like he's doing something like a DJ table or something, so it's making me think, like, maybe it's a Friday Night Funkin' oh, character. Right, which Friday Night Funkin' character has hands like that? Mm, huh? His boyfriend? Wait, wear Sonic has uh, gloves too, right? Sonic does wear gloves. So does Mario. That's why, that's why I'm so lit. You think it's Mario? It could be Mario. Wait, this is impossible. It could be Mario, Sonic, or Mickey Mouse. I'm gonna go ahead and guess Knuckles, because Knuckles does have gloves like that. Wait, but what is, is Adam's onto something? What is the hand doing? Is that like a DJ table? Yeah, it's one of those like DJ mixing tables. Okay, what character has to do with that? Mm. I think this is Mario in Friday Night Funkin'. Or it could be Sonic.exe in Friday Night Funkin'. If you get this right, you are so smart. If you get this right, you you might be um, a genius and you should go to NASA quickly to get a job. Yeah. Or Tesla. So wait, what did you? What was your final guess? I'm gonna go with Sonic.exe in Friday Night Funkin'. Wow, and I'm gonna lock in Knuckles. Okay. Ah. <laughs> wow, it was the music man from Five Nights at Freddy's. Security wow. breach, dude, is the D uh, DJ music man. He, he's DJ. Oh, we should have known that we one. We didn't even pay attention to his mouth. His mouth is in here, you see that? Yeah. Man. Okay, now we're looking at something crazy. It looks like a crystal. What is that? Is that like a Chaos Emerald or something? What? Like from Sonic? A Chaos Emerald? How did you get that? I don't know. It looks like a like a ruby or something. No, I don't it just know. looks like a pink crystal. Yeah. What character looks like this? Amy from is this, Sonic? Is this um Cassie Massey on a bad hair day? Ooh, maybe. Yeah, Amy? Yeah. I think that's what it is. That would make sense. I'm gonna guess. Oh man, this I don't even have a good guess. I'm gonna. I'm gonna stick with Amy. I think I, Amy's a pretty good guess, actually. Yeah. Wait, what is this? What are we looking at? I think the thing on the bottom left is an ear. No. I, you, you don't think so? On the bottom left is an ear with that triangle? Yeah. Okay. I think that's an ear. Whose ear is that color? Foxy. Sonic. It could be Foxy. So I think it's a Sonic character. I think it's Amy because it's pink. Okay. Yeah. I'm gonna lock in, I think it's some cotton candy. Judd's is gonna lock in cotton candy, the food. Yeah. Well, I'm thinking about food, so it's almost lunchtime. All right. Have any of the other answers been food? No. So uh, it could be the first. Okay. All right. All right. Let's see what it is. Oh, it's Sonic.exe. Oh wow. Why does he have crystals on him? If any of you guys got that, you are an actual genius. Quickly go to Tesla and get a job. Right. Okay, now what is this? What is that, like a crown? It's a crown. I don't recognize this at all. What is that, Burger King, dude? Oh, that would make sense, yeah. Burger King? It's <laughs> Foxy. Maybe it's, uh, maybe it's Royal Rocky. Oh, Royal Rocky from the Lanky Box figure. It might be Royal Rocky, dude. I, wait, what is this? What are we looking at? Is this a character? I think it's a character. Okay, what character has, like, a crown on them? Um, what? Is it? I think it's Tails. Oh, Tails, right. That's the same color as Tails. Yeah, it's the same color as Tails. That's why I'm going to guess Tails. I'll go ahead and guess. Uh, this is a crazy guess, but King Neptune from SpongeBob. Oh, because he wears a crown. Exactly. Good idea. Let's see who it is. It was the baby in yellow. Wow. Oh, I didn't even realize that he has a crown on his shirt. That was max difficulty. Any of you guys got that home, you're geniuses. Okay, guys, these are getting harder and harder. I honestly want to just quit and lay down and take a nap. Me too. And eat a corn dog. I'm out, bro. Yeah. In that order. But we have to beat this game. What is it? What are we looking at? It's a triangle. How are we supposed to know what this is from a triangle, dude? <laughs> um, okay, guys. Let's try to work this out. This, guys, if you see this and you want to give up, don't give up. We're going to prove to you right now. Lanky Bug's going to prove to you. Never give up. 
on your dreams. Like, I have a dream. I could climb walls. Yeah. And I'm working on it. Like, I can do it, guys. I'm not gonna give up, even though I want to lay down and cry. What does a green triangle tell us? Okay, here's what I'm thinking. There's a lot of what are you pink. Thinking? What are you thinking, dude? There's pink and purple, and then the thing in the middle is kind of like yellow. It's green. It's greenish. So maybe, yellow. maybe it's like Foxy eating a French fry. Foxy says, "What are you saying, eh?" You if you put Foxy at the edge of the camera, it kind of looks like the thing, and then if you put like a piece of pie in the middle, it looks like that. Hey, stop messing around. A piece of pie? Are you being ridiculous? I don't know. It, it, stop it, Adam. I'm gonna show everyone how to do this. I have no idea what I'm looking at, but what are the colors on screen? There's pink. There's green. And there's white. The, the object on the left is white. It's okay. like it's like like there's like a weird tint on the screen. Pink, green, and white. What character is pink, green, and white? Ghosties, pink and white, but no green. Who's green? Now these are characters that we all know. So that that's a big hint, dude. Mm, a pink, green, green white. character pink, with pink, green, and white. Pink, green, 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 white. A green character is Shrek. Maybe it's Shrek mm. wearing. I'm not even listening to Adam. He's uh, maybe it's Shrek wearing. A pink and green tie-dye <laughs> shirt. Maybe. Get out of here, Adam. Go, get lost. All right. Can Justin beat this on Talking his own? Angela is pink and white, but I don't think there's any green. <laughs> Unless she's in the room that Talking Bang Bang is sitting in, because that's green. Right. But that's not what I'm looking at. Pink, green, white. <gasps> no way. I got it! Wait, what is it? It's Glamrock Chica! No way! She's pink, green, and white, dude. Is that actually Chica? Let's go! Wow, guys, did you guys get that one? Never give up, guys. Let's go. Okay, now what are we looking at, guys? These are getting trickier and trickier. I thought that last one was tricky. This one is nuts. What is this? Mm -hmm. What am I looking at, dude? Okay, I don't even have a good guess for this. This is this is tough. Okay, am I? Oh, I, I got it, dude. I got I got it. Easiest thing in my life. It's an egg. <laughs> oh. It's an egg. There's an egg yolk in the middle. That's a good guess. It's an egg, dude. What's the line on the yolk? It's just a line. It's just a line. Maybe it's a little smiley face because it's like a smiley tilt. <laughs> well, we have seen that all the other answers are characters, so I don't think it's an egg. But you can Why guess Why are you being that. so negative, dude? Why are you being so negative? I'm just saying, I'm going to keep guessing. Now, guys, this one's tough. Okay. It's a yellow and white character. It's an egg. Are there any egg characters we know? <laughs> Dr. Eggman. I'm locking in Dr. Eggman. Right, guys, that does look like Dr. Eggman a yeah, little bit. It's the only egg character we know. Right. You know another one? Mm. I'll wait. I'll wait. Mm. <laughs> Got nothing. <laughs> what do you think this is, huh? I'm gonna go ahead and lock in Supersonic. Why would you do that, though? Because he's yellow, and maybe the white is like he's holding a Chaos Emerald. Oh, wait, that's actually a decent guess because he I think he has like a white belly and he also has like gloves that are white. So I think that's his mouth up top. That's the line. The the yellow is his head and wait then the minute. white is his body. Oh, wait a minute. It could be Boxy. It does kind of look like Boxy. Boxy smiles and he's the right colors. But I don't think... And Boxy's a box. He's not circular. What's Ooh. up, Boxy? <laughs> Boxy in the boat. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Boxy. You know what Boxy's doing? What? It's called the Boxy Booty Dance. <laughs> boxy Booty. Boxy the boy with the Boxy Booty. <laughs> okay, I don't, I don't think that's Boxy. Boxy has no curved lines on him. Okay, I think I'm just gonna give up then. Are you just gonna lay down and quit? Yeah, I don't have a guess. What do you got? Do you want your blankie? No. Are you just gonna lay down and take a nap? Do you want your blankie? No. You want your blankie? I'm gonna stick with Supersonic. Don't worry. Oh, here's your little blankie. Oh, the lanky box blanket. Blanky, go go lay down. You're just gonna give up? I'm not getting Dr. Eggman, bro. All right, let's see it. Mm. Oh my goodness, it's Daisy from Poppy Playtime. Wow. Oh, that is an unreleased character. How we've ever gotten that? If you got that, I'm being serious. You are an actual genius. Quickly go to school and get a promotion at school. Agreed. Yeah. Okay, now, once again, I'm completely confused. I think it's Sonic. All of these, if I don't know, I think it's Sonic. <laughs> Sonic is a good guess. What is this, dude? What is what, what is this? Huh? Gotta be a dark blue character. Yeah. Oh, man, guys, this is so tricky. What is it, dude? Mm. I think it's Sonic. It actually looks like Sonic, right? It kind of looks like Sonic. Wait, but what is that line down the middle? It's like a zipper. So it's like, this, it's like a blue hoodie? Who wears a blue hoodie? Does Catboy! Catboy! Wait, from Friday Night Funkin', Cat does Weedy wear a blue hoodie? 
No, no. way, that's witty. Yeah. <laughs> I think that's witty. I think you got it. Is that it? I think it's witty. Is it actually? <laughs> it was witty. All right. How did you get that? Okay, what do we look at? What is this, dude? What What am I looking at here? Okay, this looks like a... Is that a toilet? No, I it's a sideways toilet. It looks like it's a, a sideways toilet. Like a piece of toast it's or something. It's a sideways toilet. <laughs> mm. a sideways toilet. So I'm gonna lock in Aiden. Wait a minute. <laughs> Wait, no, you actually just gave me an idea. What? When you say sideways toilet really fast, it kind of sounds like siren head. <laughs> sideways makes him think of siren head. Yeah. Siren head. There, I don't think this is siren head though. You think siren head? No. You gonna guess it's siren head? Why are you baby talking Cause that's me? how you be thinking, bro. That's how, when the cameras are off, the that's cameras? how Adam talks. <laughs> see, see. You said uh, it. No, see. <laughs> when the cameras are off, that's how Adam talks. <laughs> Mommy, I want a warm glass of milk. <laughs> that's what he says, bro. I will use a toy with. Mm, you know what I mean? This could be Siren Head or it could be any brown character. I'm gonna go ahead I and think lock it's in. Siren Head. Yeah, I think it's the speakers coming out of his head. I don't think so. I think oh, it bro, might bro, really. be Winnie the Pooh. <laughs> Cause he's brown. What I'm gonna lock about in that. Pooh, man? <laughs> How does that look like Winnie the Pooh? Just explain your thinking. Just because he's like a bear and he's a brown bear. I'm just gonna lock that I'm in, guys. Steal answers, guess Siren Head. Okay, ready? <laughs> oh man, wait, it was right. I shouldn't have switched. It was Siren Head. Okay, what is this? Oh, I think this is um right away. I think I know. I think this is Iron Man. That's like one of his eyes. You know what I mean? All right, yeah. Well, it's like a super close up. You guys know what I mean of Iron Man? Like if you see him in his helmet, it's like a close up of his eyes. Like if we put up a picture of Iron Man, I think it's Iron Man's eyes. Yeah, I. Man, I think you're right, Dan. I kind of want to take your answer. Should we just lock in Iron Man? Wait, something. What are those lines, though? Those what are, are the lines on Iron Man. No, what? Do you recognize this? Is it waffles? Maybe waffles with butter on it. It could be waffles. And the, that, yeah, the white thing is butter. It could be um, a picture of Adam's abs. <laughs> Maybe. You know what I mean? Maybe. Adam always goes. I'm <laughs> I'm going to the gym. I'm going to the gym. And he takes a marker and he draws like abs on himself. Like, yeah, oh. Justin has actual abs though. Like oh, yeah. 12 of them. Oh, yeah. Yeah, and that's just one abs. Ab. stands for <laughs> ABS. All the bacon strips. <laughs> I got abs. Yeah, he'll put bacon on I his stomach. I got all the bacon strips. <laughs> wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Is this the back rooms? What, dude, when I said bacon, it unlocked Adam to think back rooms. Is that it? No way. It was the back rooms. That was the first one that wasn't a character. Okay, these are just getting ridiculous. I have no idea what this is. All right, guys, we're down to the final ones, and these are getting way too difficult. Wait, oh, is this boy. the back rooms also? You can see, like, a room in there. Oh, yeah, check the reflection. Like, it's... What is that? What What are we looking at, though? Looks like an office. But something about this looks like a face, right? It looks like... Wait, is it upside... It's an upside-down face. Oh, yeah, it is. Right? It's like an eyeball and it's smiling? Why is it upside down? So it's like a robot, like the lanky bot? I don't think it's the lanky bot, no. No. <laughs> Um, I don't even have a guess. Dude, what is this? Wait, there's a big hint. Look at the corner. It's green. It's bright green. Bright green. What is bright green? It has like, um, like a, like an LED eyeball. The Boogie Bot from Poppy Playtime. Today, we are seeing if we can beat this Who Said It game. Okay, everyone, now listen really closely. We're going to play a clip and we have to guess who said it. Let's go. Hey. Okay, okay. Now, now who said that sound, bro? Was it Wooly? The letter A from Alphabet Lore or Blue Rainbow Friend. Now, this is real tricky, bro. Mm -hmm. Right away when I heard that, bro. Let, let's play it again right now. Hey. When I heard that, I had this feeling I want to go like this, bro. Wait, really? Why? I don't know. I was thinking it might be Wooly from A Man of yeah, the Adventure. Yeah, yeah, Because doesn't, doesn't he say like, Wooly? Well, anybody say, hey, Amanda, his friend. Right. Hey, Amanda, the adventurer. Right. Or was it the letter A from Alphabet? That Lord? would make sense. I don't think it was Blue. Blue Rainbow Friend just says, Rrr. It wasn't Blue. So I, we're think gonna... it, I think it might have been A from Alphabet Lord because he just comes up and goes, hey. Let's lock that in. Let's lock in A, bro. Was it A, bro? It was the letter A! Yeah. 
Okay, that was real tricky, but I don't even know what they even said, bro. They were like, We'll play it one more time. All right, play it again. Now, now, Justin loves watching Paw Patrol. Yeah. You think it might be Marshall from Paw Patrol? I don't, I, I don't know. I don't think it was Marshall. I don't think he says stuff like that. Marshall I, is a firefighter. Yeah. So maybe it was like, fire, yeah. or something like that. Yeah, that, what you said right there, made a lot of sense mm, it might be green Everyone, from rainbow Lord. use your whole brain right now and help us figure this out we need help it might have been green i think it was green because green we don't really know what green sounds like and he goes right exactly you know I mean? or it could be g from the alphabet lore wait what 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 does g sound like from the alphabet lore isn't uh, it isn't it kind of like that g no he says g -g 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 Oh yeah, he uses the horn. G, yeah, G. So yeah. it's not G. So it's gotta be green. I, mean, I think it's great rainbow for it. All right, let's lock it in. <laughs> let's see if we got it right, guys. It was G. Oh man, you got that wrong. Oh. Bro, who said that, bro? Was it Luisa the Minions or L, bro? Now, guys, we have seen Encanto about a thousand times. Yeah. Now, Louisa loves carrying yeah. donkeys yeah. on her back. Oh, yeah. I don't think it's Louisa. Uh, I think it might be a minion. I can't believe it. I think it might be a minion, like, when, when Gru, like, falls them and they're like, oh. Right, because Gru does take L. Banana, banana. You know what I mean? Vector. Mm. You know, maybe when they oof, Vector. That's maybe true, like, guys. Oh. Right, guys, the rise of Gru. L on Vector. Yeah. Oh, Victor. Or is it L from the alphabet, I Lord? think it might be L, bro. Oh, because he says that. I know he says that, guys. I watched Alphabet Lore 500 times. Guys, if you want to see us watch Alphabet Lore for the first First time ever. Go on YouTube, look up Lanky Box World Alphabet Lore. We watched it for the first time. You can also see me watch it with Foxy for the first time ever, and Foxy's reaction was crazy. Yeah, guys, you gotta go check out Lanky Box World. We're gonna lock in L from Alphabet Lore. Is that right? I know it's L, bro. Let's go! Got it! Oh. X. What, bro? What they even say, bro? What? Piggy, X, or Blue. Now, this is tricky, bro. I feel like it might be Blue Rainbow Friend because that's the second time we've seen his name. Yeah, I think it might be Blue. Maybe after he's done eating a character and he, like, burps. That sounded a little bit like a burp. We're going to play it one more time. All right, let's listen to it. X. I think it's blue after he eats a player. I had him burps like that, bro. After he after he does drink a bunch of blah, blah, blah. <laughs> And his mom has to do that thing where she puts him over and she <laughs> burps him. Yeah, it's lit. Uh, it it's be, lit. It do, be, it do be lit. All right. It's, now, I don't think it's Piggy. It's not Piggy. So it's either X from Alphabet Lore or it's blue from Rainbow I Friends. I feel like they said X, but I honestly heard them almost say F. Mm. I can't, we can't play it again, guys. I don't know what it is. I'm gonna lock in X. I think, wait, I thought when X shows up, he just like multiplies. I didn't know he said his own name. I'm gonna say X. All right, let's lock in X. All right. It was X. Got it. Wow, X is pretty cool, guys, but he gets oofed by F in Alphabet Lore right away. F. Bro, was that X again, bro? Was that F Gru or Amanda the Adventurer, bro? Mm, so it I sounded like, uh, but I don't know. Maybe, maybe Amanda. I was gonna say there's no way that's Amanda because she says, "Let's go to the store." But maybe it's like Monster Amanda. Yeah, uh, it might be Amanda. It might also be Gru. Maybe if like a minion accidentally hurts him or something, and he goes, uh, or, or maybe, something like um, that. When he gets his homework back, his grade is. Uh, oh right, wait, yeah. I'm pretty sure they said F, dude. Uh, let's listen to that again, bro. Yeah. I'm pretty sure it's F. I think it's F from Alphabet Lord, bro. We're gonna lock in F. Lock Here we go, F, bro. It was F. All right. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go. Um, what? What was that? Cuphead. Okay, Cuphead, Thor, or M. Mm. I think I feel like that was Thor, bro. I, I, right away, I thought it was Thor. I think it was when he grabs his hammer and there's like a lightning bolt mm. on it. He goes, Ugh, like with the hammer. And it's, it's lit, guys. I what love Avengers. What was that face? What was that, bro? It's when he gets shocked by lightning. Oh, yeah. right. Yeah. Right. Now, Cuphead, it might be when Cuphead is battling um, the giant pirate boss. Yes. Not sure. It though. might also just be, um, the letter. Um, 
And mom took us to see um, <laughs> Avengers Endgame. Right. And Adam, um, right before we went to go see movie, he drank a big gallon of milk. Yeah, not the half gallon. I had no, the whole had gallon. The whole gallon. So, Right as the movie started, he went to the bathroom. Yeah. And then by the time he came back, the movie was over. Yeah, I walked back in the theater and the credits were rolling and Justin <laughs> was sitting there clapping. Oh, it was lit. Oh, yeah. <laughs> he was the only one there. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Well, it was in our living room. Right, it was lit. Yeah. It was lit. Cool. We're going to lock in M from Alphabet Lord. I think it's M when it transforms, bro. Let's do it. It was M. Cool. Let's go, guys. This is easy. Let's keep going. What was that, bro? Was that pink from Rainbow Friends, P from Alphabet Lore, or C, Wario from Mario? I don't even know what I just heard. <laughs> I heard like a, like a, like a, it sounded like a ruler hit like a table or something. Guys, we're gonna play it one more time. Okay. All right. That might be Wario. <laughs> What is funny about that, man? Wario from Mario has a very unique voice. I don't know. Wario! Or something like see, that. See, Adam Noka, he plays Wario. All right, guys. Well, we play on Nintendo Switch! Right, guys. Justin will sometimes play as, like, Kirby or, um... Yeah, yeah, yeah. he likes doing the inhale move. Yeah, and, and Adam does Wario. He does the fart attack, bro. The what? I just, I, he does it in real life. I don't! At the same time. I don't. And that's cheating. Don't. I don't. <laughs> yes, he does. No, I don't. I have to leave the room. I don't. And then he oops my character in Super <laughs> Smash Bros. And he says, ha, ha, ha. I oofed you. I didn't even oof once. That's what he says, bro. Guys, I don't That's think it says. Bro. I don't think it's Wario. We're going to put an X over that one. It's either pink from Rainbow Friends or it's P from Alpha Lore. But I don't think it's pink because pink has not been revealed yet. We don't know what they sound like. You're right. I think it's P, 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 P. Although, although I feel like they sound like pee pee pee. I think that's what she. I think that's what. I think that's what P says. Right, right, right. I agree. Okay. Let's lock in P. I'm gonna lock in letter P. Please, please. Let's go. Yeah. We're feeling really good at this game, guys. Let us know how you're doing in the comments. Okay, who's next? C. I'm pretty sure I just heard C, and I love the letter C. It was a C, Huggy Wuggy, Huggy Wuggy does not sound like Huggy Wuggy sounds like, hey, I'm Huggy. Yeah, it's not Huggy Wuggy. Is it Sonic though? Sonic might be like, might, maybe instead of C, they said, I need some speed. Oh, speed or Amy, something like that. Yeah, you know, what? Like Amy. <laughs> <laughs> like, I don't know. Adam, you say that. Right, guys. Adam goes up to his mom and says, I love Amy. <laughs> From Sonic. <laughs> That's true. So uh, that is true and real. Now we're gonna play that sound one more time. Okay. C. Mm. Mm. That has to be C. That gotta be C when he comes in the alphabet lore. I'm I'm almost sure. I've seen alphabet lore 9999999999 times. All right, we're gonna lock in C from alphabet lore. Please. Let's go, dude. I know what I'm talking about. Got it. It's C. E. What? Okay, was that Boyfriend from Friday Night Funkin', Red from Rainbow Friends, or E from Alphabet? I don't think it, Boyfriend mm. just goes, ah, ooh, ah, ooh, ah. Mm, right, that's true, he sounds like a robot. I don't think it's Red, mm. Red Science has done the same thing. Or when he does, in Rainbow Friends, it goes, That's true, yeah, that's true. I'm pretty sure it's E, I think it's E from Alphabet Lore. I think we lock it in. I gotta lock in E, bro. Yeah, let's do it. Lock it in, bro. Lock it in, bro. Yup! Easy! Yep, yep. Easy, we got him. We got him good now. Oh. Okay, guys, was that Baymax from Big Hero 6, O, or the Squid Game doll? I don't think it's Squid Game doll. It's a leak. I'm in Squid Game Season 2. And 3. I'm in Squid Game Season 2. That's true, guys. Netflix flew to Justin's house. And, and 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 brought him to the Squid Game show, and he won, guys, in season two and they, three. They, they, they knew I'm the Squid Kid. Right, guys, Doc, Mr. Netflix himself flew Justin out <laughs> to the Squid Game area. I'll put you in the Squid Game. Cause it's squid kid. <laughs> and it did happen. Right guys, I didn't see it actually happen. I think he might just be faking it and it no, was just a dream. No, guys. I'm not sure. Now, I don't even know the sound. The sound, honestly, it sounded like a boot sequence 
for Baymax. So he's a robot. When he wakes up, he goes, Ooh. you know what I mean? Right. It might be a boot sequence for Baymax. <laughs> What's so funny? I know what's funny, bro. What? Max, he said, are you serious? Hey, them. What? What's so funny about a boot sequence? <laughs> <laughs> Guys, I'm gonna lock in O from Alphabet Lore. I think it's O. We're I'm gonna, gonna lock in Baymax. Let's play it one more time and make sure we're correct. Oh. That mm. sounds to me like a robot starting up. I think it's Baymax. I think it's O. I'm gonna lock that in. I, I wasn't allowed to watch Baymax, but I'm gonna guess it's Baymax. Come on! <laughs> it was O! D. Okay, that one has to be D from Alphabet Lore. Probably, it's gotta be D, bro. Or, or was it Tiny Mo? Or it might be Chase from Paw Patrol. No, I know it's not that one. Mm. No, of course not. Mm, I mean, it could be Chase, guys. I'm not sure. It could be Daddy Longlegs. Oh, yeah. Maybe it's Daddy Longlegs saying his own name. Yeah, maybe he comes and say D for D. -D. Right. D Daddy yeah, Longlegs. Yeah, that's what I'm saying, bro. But mm. I don't think we've ever heard him talk. We've only seen trailers of Pipe Play Dab Chapter 3. Right. So you think it's D from Alphabet Lore? I think it might be D from Alphabet Lore. I'm locking D D for I'm, Alpha Lore. I'm just gonna go ahead and guess that it's that it's Daddy Longlegs. Okay, really, bro? Yeah. Really? Yeah, I'm gonna guess, guys. All right. Oh, uh, it was D. That was a good guess, though. Hey, that's a good guess. And Boxy says, good, 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 good guess, hey, no. Thank you, Boxy. <laughs> Hug your daddies. <laughs> All right, bro. Let's go, bro. What, what was that, bro? Was that Luigi, Knuckles, or K? I mm. honestly, like, the, the, it sounded like running at first. Like, someone's running really fast. Like Luigi. I feel like it was Luigi or Knuckles. Mm. Maybe Knuckles says that. Maybe Knuckles, like, ran really fast. So that's what it sounded like. And then he goes, ah! Right, because Knuckles. He's so tired of running. Knuckles' name starts with a K. What? So it might be Knuckles. Mm. What? I, I think it's either I Knuckles. Think it's Knuckles. I think it's Knuckles. I, I do that sometimes when, I, um, when I'm in PE class with Adam. Mm -hmm. I run. I run really fast and then I go. <laughs> right, he does. <laughs> Just like that and it sounded like that. I'm going to go with Knuckles. Well, let's play it one more time here, guys. <laughs> yeah, it's yeah. Knuckles. It's Knuckles. All right, we got he that one. Do, let's see. He, he do be running. Here we go, guys. Yeah, we are lit. Oh, it was K from Alphabet Lore. How is that K? K doesn't run. Oh, it wasn't running. It was the sound of wings flapping, dude. Oh. oh. What? what was that, bro? What was that? Was that orange from Rainbow Friends, R, or SpongeBob? I don't think it was SpongeBob. Mm. SpongeBob. Woo. Maybe. No, that's. We got SpongeBoxy right here. Limited edition. Right, guys. Once he's gone, he's gone. I don't think it's SpongeBob. goes. Duh! I don't think it's SpongeBob, but it might have been. It was like, uh, uh, mm. I feel like it was orange. Orange. Like when he oops you. Uh. Right. Yeah. When he's running after the food packs. You think it's orange? Or you think it's R? I don't know what R from Alpha Lore sounds like. Uh, R. It might be R. What did I get? Uh, R. That's what. <laughs> wait, guys. Let's play the sound one more time. Oh. Uh. Yeah, I think it's R from Alphabet Lore. Yeah, do that one more time. Uh, R. Yeah. Bro. Yeah, guys. Sometimes when my mom comes home with the chocolate milk instead of the normal, I'll just make that sound. Why? Because <laughs> it's lit. <laughs> That's the sound you make when it's lit? <laughs> yeah. When it's only lit, you do that? Yeah. <laughs> it's Squidward. It's Squidward like he bought. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm locking orange and I'm being ridiculous thinking it's R, bro. <laughs> it was R! I don't know what R sounds like. I I, I forgot. Okay, I forgot. Hey. What was that, bro? Um, was that T purple from Rainbow Friends or turning red? Well, what was that sound before, bro? It's like sound it sounded like it was squishing. Maybe it was a red panda, like Walking around? The red panda eating some bamboo. Right, exactly. I think it might be Mei Lee from Turning Red. Do pandas eat bamboo? Yeah, I, I know they do, because I saw it in Kung Fu Panda. Right, right, right. Or it could be purple. Um, We're going to play one more time. It might be the vent, like purple walking around in the vent. It might be squishy, squishy, because it's in the vent. Let's play one more time. No, I'm pretty sure they just said T at the end. I don't remember that from Alphabet Lore, but I'm locking T. Let Let's do it. Let's do it. Okay. It was T! Got it! Let's go, dude. We're on a roll. Z. 
What was what? that? What was that? It went, Ugh. I think it's the Hulk. That sounds right. Hulk, Hulk. Rainy, or Z? Ugh. Z from Alphabet Lore. Uh, I don't think Z, isn't Z a planet? He doesn't talk, does he? No, I think it's Hulk. I think it's, I don't, it's not Granny Granny. It's I see you. I think it's Hulk when he's doing the Hulk smash, guys. I think so. Yeah, that, that is what Hulk sounds like. Alright guys, lock in Hulk. Let's see if we got it right, guys. Lock in your guesses right now. We're gonna show the answer. Final round. How would that was Z? Oh man, today we're seeing if we can solve these crazy riddles. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now guys, we gotta choose who is more dangerous, okay? The puffer fish or the <laughs> what is that? A stingray? Ooh, so both of these animals are underwater. I don't know which one is actually more dangerous. I've never seen either of these in real life. The puffer fish <laughs> looks pretty scary though. Yeah, it's like Mrs. Puff. It's like me. <laughs> I get huge. Yeah. Okay, now, how could that be more dangerous? What is this? What is this? Some sort of... <laughs> All right, guys, make sure you play along in the comments. See if you can get these right. I think these videos have the actual data and science on who would win. Right. Now, the stingray, I believe it can sting you. Is this who more dangerous? Like, who oofs more, like, animals or, like, humans? It's who oofs more humans per year. Huh? So, we have to decide which one oofs more people on the average. fish not going to oof humans. How do you get oofed by this guy? Well, pufferfish is one of those fishes that gets super big with spikes on it. So maybe if someone picked it up and was like playing with it and then it like all of a sudden got huge, it would just oof you. Ah! Yeah. Okay, I think it's got to be the stingray because it has the word sting. <laughs> hey, what's so funny? Well, go, go ahead. It has the word sting. <laughs> what's funny? No, go ahead. No, what's funny? I was saying, I, I saw a video of a pufferfish eating a carrot and it's real scary. That's what you're thinking of? Yeah. I'm trying to explain the logic here. Wait, if we can put a video on screen of a pufferfish eating a carrot, that will show you these guys are crazy. That's how Adam eats. I know what video you're talking about. <laughs> That's how Adam eats when he's sitting in his little booster chair. I'm a lock in puffer. I'm a lock in stingray. It has the word sting in its name. It's got a sting laser beam ray. It's gonna oof a lot of people. Let's see. All right, let's go. What? Six <laughs> oofs per year. How does it oof people, guys? Somebody let us know in the comments. How does this fishy oof people? All right, next round. Nah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Okay, now, you're being ridiculous now. <laughs> this game's ridiculous. Who's more dangerous, a bear or a cow? I would probably say a cow. Why? Because what if someone's deathly allergic to milk and they drink it and they... That's not they the cow's ooh. fault. That doesn't count. That doesn't count. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Guys, play along because we actually have a secret animal race video to show you at the end as well. Okay, I could see maybe the cow could be dangerous if it like sits on a farmer. <laughs> that's funny to you? Like that's funny? That's people oofing. You laughing. You think a cow's gonna sit on a farmer? It might. <laughs> and then you will oof because that looks very heavy. A farmer is not dumb enough to let a cow sit on him. You don't know. <laughs> Old McDonald had a cow and it's on him. Wow. wow. I'm gonna say cows, dude. All right, you, you're trolling. A no. bear could oof about 10 cows. Could a cow beat a bear in a battle? No. But that's not what we're doing. We're not saying <laughs> who will win. We're saying who oofs more humans. Right. It's gotta be the bear, dude. A bear just go one time. How would a cow even oof somebody? All right, I'm, I'm a lock in cow. Jazzy's gonna lock in bear. Let's see who's Adam right. I'm gonna say a cow oofs more people by drowning them in. <laughs> <laughs> okay. No! Yeah! No, somebody let us know in the comments. How is it even possible? How does a cow even oof somebody? It just runs into them? Like I guess so, yeah. Or maybe it kicks it like with its hind legs or something. A cow kick people? Yeah. Man, are you kidding me? Okay, now we got a chimpanzee or a deer. Okay, now this one is tricky, bro. So both could be dangerous. Like if you steal a banana from a chimpanzee, look, he does not look happy. But <laughs> the deer has those antlers that it could probably just jam inside you. How often you think people steal <laughs> from chimpanzees? I mean, I don't know. Probably a lot. I would say the deer probably. Only because I would be friends with the chimpanzees. Really? Yeah. Why? Because I can speak to them. Really? <laughs> 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 
<laughs> so guys, if there's any chimpanzees watching, they'll know what Justin said. Yeah. What did you just tell them? <laughs> I said I'm hungry. What's pizza? That's what I said. Okay, well, I'm gonna lock in chimpanzee. I'm gonna say deer, dude. This thing has like thorns growing out of its head. This gotta oof more people. That's true, but that chimpanzee looks angry. No, it looks happy. What do you mean? <laughs> this how Adam looks when he gets some mail. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's see the answer. Right, let's go. Oh! Let's go! 120 oops per year. That's more than a bear and a cow and everything. I could believe that though for sure. Yeah, th this looks very dangerous, guys. Who's <laughs> <laughs> more dangerous than children? That's one big children! <laughs> Or versus a cone snail. Now, ice cream cone. Immediately, guys, you might be thinking, well, how would a snail if anyone is this big? But I do know snails can be poisonous. So I'm trying they could to think. just slither on your mouth and then you. Uh, oh. The poison DNA is already in you. It's too late. Right. And I don't think chickens can be poisonous, right? I could have chuckled. <laughs> so what, you know what Adam would say? What if someone allergic to eggs? <laughs> That's true. That is very that true. Count? What if a chill could just pecks you to oof? That would take a long time. <laughs> how, how would a chill could even oof somebody? It's not even possible, bro. Hmm. Maybe if you're like driving and the chicken tries to cross the road and you have to swerve to the side and you and you oof. Why is it chill you cross the road? To oof people. What? Yeah. I would say the snail. I and this this seems it says cone snail. That's probably a specific type of very venomous snail. Yeah, I'll go ahead and lock in the chicken. Okay, I would say a snail. Wow! 164 deaths per year from a chicken. This isn't real. This must be inaccurate. How's it oof 100 people a year? How? No, uh, this is totally how? real, guys. How, how, how? Guys, let us know in the comments. How is that possible? This literally has to be like somebody eats an eggy weggy and then he's allergic. I think how it happens is maybe like the feathers from the chicken falls off and it goes inside of someone's throat and they choke on it or something. Or, yeah, the chicken <laughs> sits on you. <laughs> Just like the cow. Now, all we're learning is farm animals are dangerous. Right. Huh? Okay, now it's a little bit different. We gotta decide who is the fastest. <laughs> Who's the fastest in the jungle kingdom? We got a, what's this, Komodo dragon. A dragon. Versus a sea turtle. So, That's guys, turtle. we gotta see which one can move faster. Now, I think Komodo dragons are pretty quick. I mean, it has dragon. It can fly. <laughs> Obviously, the dragon, bro. But the sea turtle, on land, it's probably pretty slow. But in water, I bet it's really good at swimming. But I don't think so, because aren't sea turtles like 900 years old? Yeah. They're not gonna swim super fast. I saw Finding Nemo, and Ooh. that guy was just chilling. Mm. You know what I'm saying? He would chill it. Yeah, Crush. It's got to be the Komodo dragon. It's got to be the Komodo dragon. I think it's the turtle. I think it's trying to like make me think, oh, turtles are slow. They're not fast. I bet they're actually really fast. Which one would you rather get chased by? Which one would catch you, huh? You think the sea gonna... turtle will probably snap at my toes. I would not want snap that. Snap at Adam swim trunks. <laughs> <laughs> and then Adam be in the water just away <laughs> <wet> his boobs. <laughs> okay. You know what I mean? What does that have to do with who's fastest? I don't Oh, no. I'm a lock in turtle. I'm gonna say the Komodo dragon, bro. It better be the dragon. Oh, what? <laughs> the turtle can swim at 21 miles an hour. <laughs> it probably can get that fast if it's swimming in a current, <laughs> like underwater. Well, that's not fair. All right, here we go. Next round. Okay, who's the fastest, a tiger or a gazelle? Now, right away, I'm thinking it's gonna be the gazelle, bro. Man, this one's actually very hard because I think both of them are pretty quick at a running. A gazelle, I don't know what a gazelle is. It looks like a deer. Like, look how fast. Actually, these legs, could it go that fast? These legs, those are really skinny legs, man. Yeah, that's true. But this guy looks like he's made to run, man. He looks like Bambi. I think it's the tiger. Oh, because in the wilderness, the tiger will probably catch the gazelle and oof it. Right, yeah. Don't oof him. He's cute looking. Yeah, that's true. And the tiger probably eats a lot of frosted flakes. The tiger's cute looking too. Yeah, they're great. <laughs> that's true. I'm not allowed to have frosted flakes. There's so much sugar. I just hurry. <laughs> <laughs> I get really fast if I eat them. So maybe, yeah, maybe it's 
tiger. I'll let you decide what you want to pick. Tony the tiger. At the end, that secret racing video that we're going to show you guys later, that might actually settle which one's faster, okay, but we'll watch that in a bit. I, I think it's the gazelle, bro. All right, I'll lock in tiger. I think it's the gazelle. All right, let's go. Let's go! Wow, 43 miles an hour. That's a really close race. 40 miles per hour? That's real fast, guys. That's ridiculously fast. Wow. wow. And who's the fastest? We got Fox. See, we got a little Fox. Or we got a hippo pod. <laughs> <laughs> it's gotta be the fox. What do you mean? A hippo walks so slow. I think the hippo is actually pretty fast. Because hippos can swim. Right. And I think hippos are really good at swimming. Hmm. This one's real tricky. Um. It's gotta be the fox, man. It's not even close, man. Guys, play along. I, I really don't know what the answer is. That's what a hippopotamus looks like? Yeah. We saw these at the zoo. I only seen the one on um backyard again. Oh. <laughs> we saw this at the zoo? Yeah, remember? No, I was too busy hanging out with the penguins. Oh, right, 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 right. <laughs> That's all I do. I go to the zoo. I do that for about three hours. <laughs> I'll say the hippo. It's gotta be the fox. Let's go! Wow! Woo! That makes sense. Okay, now we got a cheetah or a falcon. Now this might be very tricky. I'm thinking everybody knows cheetahs are fast. That's like what they're known for. Falcon can fly. Right, and this is like the falcon flying speed versus the cheetah running speed. Yeah, because the falcon can't run. But that's Chester Cheetah. Wow, Chester Cheetah looks so cool. Mm. Yeah, what if, but did the cheetah eat Cheetos before the race? Yeah, yeah that might be. That's important to remember. Mm. If it ate flaming Hot Cheetos, he'd be going wrong everywhere. Let's say neither of the animals ate anything before the race. This guy would eat Cheetos and this guy would eat Fruit Loops. Oh, yeah. Because of Toucan Sam. Yeah. I, I'm gonna lock in the Falcon. I think the Falcon might be faster because it could fly. You want to take that guess? No, I'll say Chester the Cheetah. I believe in Cheetos. Okay, here we go. Oh! It was the Falcon! Wow, that was a close race, though. Okay, now we have to spot the hidden animal. What? What are we looking at? Some leaves? Yeah, these are just a bunch of leaves. What? There's no animal here. Wait a minute. Is uh, that actually an animal? Where? Okay, guys, I'll trace it with the mouse. I think this is the head of the this animal. The, of what? This is the body. These are the legs. Do you guys see that? Damn. And this is like the tail. What kind of animal is that? I think it probably evolved to look like this. So that way, like, birds and stuff don't even see it. It just looks like a leaf. That's real cool. Yeah, why don't you make like a tree and leaf? <laughs> okay. Make like a tree and leaf. <laughs> You're saying this is animal? Was that chameleon? I think this is like a type of chameleon, yeah. Let's see if you're right, Adam. No way! Wow, wow. that's crazy. It was a chameleon. Okay, we gotta spot another hidden animal. Now this was tricky. Oh, I see a little bug right here. Ha! <laughs> mm, that might also just be like a rock. It's a snail. I think it's like a big animal. What? We're looking at a tree. How can it be a big animal? You see a squirrel? Guys, let us know in the comments if you see this. I'm looking really hard. I don't see anything. Yeah, guys, look super close. Do you guys see anything? I I think I might see something. I think you might be cheating somehow. Guys, I'm not gonna say where it is, but I think I might see an owl. Like a bird. What? Yeah. Oh, oh. Do you see the owl? I'm looking. All right. I see a snail. Okay. That's an animal. I see a stick bug right here. All right. That's a stick bug. Anything else? I'm looking. <laughs> <laughs> I see it. Where? I actually see the owl. No. Look, you got two little eyes and a beak. I, I think that's just some bark. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, if you look close, I think the owl is right here. So look, this what? is the ears. Th these are the eyes. And this is the body. Do you see Where are this? the eyes? What do you mean? Right here. This is one of the eyes and this is the other eye. Oh, its eyes are closed. Yeah. No, that's the owl. Look, there's the <laughs> eye and the beak. <laughs> Obviously, let's see who's right. Are you ready to be amazed? I am. Yeah. With the owl right here. Clearly. Right here. <laughs> no way. <laughs> okay. 
Okay, now, what animal is this, guys? Let us know if you can get these at home. What kind of dog are we looking at? So it's either a crocodile or an alligator. I don't even know the difference between what? the two. Crocodile or alligator. That's a golden retriever. That is not a golden retriever. What kind of dog is this, <laughs> and why does it look like that? <laughs> this isn't a dog, Justin. This is huh? a gator. What? Yeah. Gatorade. Something like that, yeah. Montgomery Gator. I was just thinking that, yeah. But, okay, I actually, I know there is a difference between a crocodile and an alligator. I just don't know what it is. Is there a difference? I think so. Guys, let us know if you know what the difference is. They're two different animals? Yeah. Huh? And this is one of them? Yeah, I'm gonna say it's an alligator. Let's say it's a crocodile. Okay. Crocodile. Let's see what the answer is. Okay. Now, Montgomery Gator is an alligator because his gator. So, yeah. Okay, that's why Adam picked alligator probably. It was an alligator. Oh, cool. What's the difference? Uh, I don't know. Guys, let us know in the comments if you know the difference. Well, I thought these were one animal, bro. Yeah. Maybe the crocodile is like the brother and the alligator is a saster. I don't know. Yeah. Okay, now it's either a rabbit or a hare. A rabbit or a hare. I That's thought, not a hare. I, no, like a hare is a type of animal. These are all new animals I never saw in the picture books. Right. I'm going to say this That's is a, a rabbit. I'm going to say it's a hare. Yeah, because I think rabbit. rabbits, rabbits kind of look like Mr. Hops. That doesn't look like Mr. Hops. That's one thick rabbit, though. <laughs> yeah, he's eating a lot of carrots. Dude, is that a rabbit or a hare? Which, what kind is Vanny? A rabbit or a hare? A rabbit. Hey, I'm saying rabbit. All right. Easy, easy. Let's go! Oh, you got it! What's that? So, ba basically, rabbits <laughs> just be super thick? <laughs> I don't know the difference. Let us know also in the comments. Okay, what kind of cat is this? Uh, okay, it's either a leopard or a jaguar. Are these, like, types of cats? These are are kind of, they're like wild cats. So, that's a cheetah, so it's neither. <laughs> I don't have any idea. That's, that's a cheetah. What the difference is between a leopard or it's a It's a trick one? question, dude. That's a, that's a cheetah. I don't think that's a cheetah. What, what do you mean? Cheetahs look different. We just saw a cheetah. Yeah. There are this many animals on the planet? Yeah. I thought there was cats, dogs, and chocolates. <laughs> and cows. That's about it. Yeah, what? there's more than that, though. This is, a, this is like a big cat. I'll say Jack. Jaguar. I think it's a leopard. All right, let's see. I'm just guessing. I had no idea. If I get it right, though, I knew all along. If okay. I got it wrong, I'm getting hacked. Jaguar. Leopard. Oh, what? Wow, oh, I got it right. What's the difference, bro? And there's a cheetah somewhere? Wow. And tigers? They're all different. And lions? Huh? Okay, now these are just getting ridiculous. Is it a turtle or a tortoise? Those are the same thing, bro. I think the difference between them is the tortoise is a lot better. Bigger. So I think this I think is it's a, a tortoise. I think it's a turtle. Because <laughs> turtles are all cute and they just love eating like grapes. You think it's and a turtle? I think, it's, I think it's a tortoise. Do you know if you rearrange the letters in tortoise, it spells to rise. <laughs> 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 wow, your brain just works in crazy ways. <laughs> All right, let's see what the answer is. It says toot rise. <laughs> you see that? Oh, no! nice! Go! So that's interesting. A turtle has flippers. Oh, wow. Guys, we don't know if any of these videos are scientifically accurate. We're sorry if they're not. Oh, now we got, is it the Fribal Rama? <laughs> is that llama or what's this? Al alpaca. Alpaca. What is this, bro? What are these animals? I know a llama. That looks like a llama. Looks like when we go to the petting zoo. Adam, uh, he loves the llamas. Yeah, because look at their necks. It makes me feel like I'm not the only one with a super long neck anymore. I don't think that, is that a llama? Maybe it's an alpaca. Llamas have like, um, sometimes they have like the funny haircuts. You know what I mean? Yeah, so which one you want to lock in? I'll say this one's an alpaca. I'll say it's a llama. Okay. Adam likes the llamas because it reminds him of his mama. <laughs> and, and, and I don't like drama. Oh, wait, no alpacas have the funny haircuts. Are you kidding? Once again, we have a funny looking dog. <laughs> needs to get a haircut. We got a, either a hedgehog or a porcupine. I think I actually know this one. I think I actually know this one. All right, let everyone know what it is. A hedgehog is like sod. Right, they run really fast. Guy, I don't know if he could run really fast. A hedgehog, I know people have hedgehogs as pets. They're like really small. I've seen videos on the internet. I think it's a porcupine. I think I'm gonna go with hedgehog. You think that's Sonic? Yeah, I'll go with hedgehog. I'm gonna go with porcupine. Can I get it? Yeah! Wow! Okay, now guys, this 
is the secret race video. Who will win, a kitty cat or a lion? Okay, guys, choose your teams right now. I'm gonna go team kitty cat. I'm gonna go team lion. You think a cat could be a lion in a race? Let's find out. Guys, let us know in the comments which team you are right now. Three, two, one, let's go. We're off to the races, dude. Oh, man. All right, nice, okay, okay. We got the lion taking the outside track. If we lose, it's because we had to run further because we're on the outside of the track. Oh, come on, kitty cat. Okay, but if we win, it was totally fair and we did it. Okay, lion's catching up. The lion is pretty thick. The lion, the, the, yeah, we, be, we do be thick. Yeah, we're looking pretty good. Oh, lion's coming in the lead. Let's go! Okay, now this one gets pretty sad. Okay, Why? ready? PE teacher Mike worked in a school. Okay, cool. there's Mike. Yeah, he chilling. Mike yeah. chilling. It is you. He was a professional football oh, player. Oh, big chilling. Look at him go. Yo, boom. But then he got injured. Uh, okay, yeah, that's not good. He had little choice but to work as a teacher. Okay. Mike became a completely different person. Okay. He was always angry and rude. Okay. His wife left him and he was all alone. Mike was proud of his past. Yeah, okay, that's cool. That's cool. He dusted his trophies almost every day. That's cool, yeah. The children and teachers hated him and his lessons. Oh, okay. <laughs> Dude, that guy kind of looks like me. <laughs> <laughs> okay. One morning, the kids found Mike knocked out in his office. <laughs> Are you serious? Detective Smith arrived at the scene of the crime. He was poisoned. Why? We found a poison in the cleaner. What cleaner? The trophy cleaner. What? The detective Detectives interrogated all the teachers. Okay. Now, the math teacher said, I was in class with the fifth graders. Okay, yeah. The chemistry teacher said, this is my first day. I haven't even met Mr. Stiller. Uh-huh. Okay. They hired me instead of the teacher who has just retired. This teacher said, I've just come to hold a lesson. And this guy said, he was my colleague. I respected him very much. Okay. Okay. Who poisoned Mike? Okay, so, <laughs> he was a soccer player. He failed Dude. and became a PE teacher. Dude. He was cleaning his trophies and they found poison in in the cleaning bottle that he was using to clean his trophy, and you have to figure out who did it. Can we back up? What was the whole point of that entire backstory? <laughs> Other than to depress me. <laughs> to make you feel sad for him. Why does that matter? Because now you want to figure out who poisoned him. You want to redemption him. I do have a few things to help you with this riddle. I want you to pretend like you are Mike, and maybe if you get inside his mind, you'll be able to figure it out. Okay. Instead of solving the riddle like a normal human being, I'm I'm gonna reenact Mike's entire <laughs> life. Here we go. Okay. All right, I'm Mike. I'm a pro soccer player. Yeah. Let me do a bicycle kick. Oh, 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 oh. Okay. I'm injured. Oh, I can't play anymore. I gotta be a PE teacher. Okay. I'm with the students. I'm Everyone with the hates students. you. The students don't like. <laughs> ah, they're beating me up. Ah, I have to go home and dust my trophy. <laughs> <laughs> now that you have relived Mike's life, do you know who poisoned you? Now that I have done that entire reenactment, I have absolutely no idea <laughs> why you had me do that. <laughs> now, right away, I noticed that there are two chemistry teachers. Uh-huh. That's a red flag. Something's wrong there. There can only be one chemistry teacher. Maybe the school has a lot of kids that want to be scientists, so they have to have two different teachers. Possible? <laughs> The math teacher, I was in class with the fifth graders. That sounds totally true. Chemistry teacher, this is my first day. I haven't even met Mr. Stiller. They hired me instead of the teacher who was just retired. Chemistry teacher, I just come to hold a lesson. One of them's lying. The dance teacher, he's chilling. So you think it's one of the two chemistry teachers? It has to be. Because there's two chemistry teachers. Yeah. Who do you think looks more suspicious? The blonde woman or the brunette woman? I'm not going to judge them by their appearances. I'm okay. going to read closely. This is my first day. I haven't even met Mr. Stiller. They hired me instead of the teacher who just retired. I've just come to hold the lesson. I think she just retired. She lied. She's back at school for no reason and I don't understand why she would do this. I'm Wait, was she look. earlier in the room? Oh, dude! I'm a... Jesus! <laughs> the children and teachers hated him. There she is. She's the only teacher that doesn't like him. She hates him. It was her. Dude! Or it was... It was not me. She was retired and then came back for no reason to poison him. Thank you. I will now accept my Oscar for big brains. Do you have a trophy room like this with pictures of yourself? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. All for what? Points. Competitive speed eating. 
<laughs> you know? Okay, let's see what the answer is. The answer is the chemistry teacher. She is retired and she has no classes. Whoa, I got Dude. that right. Okay, Justin got that one right. Now that riddle was actually pretty tough. I'm going to put my own riddle at the end of this show. If you want to solve Justin's riddle and he might DM some of you guys to get it right. And we're going to run to the next riddle right now, which is who is rich? Who's rich? Okay, now there are three people that are in jail. Yeah. And you have to tell me out of these three people, which one of them is rich? Wait, they're in jail? Yeah. There's a guy on the left uh -huh. who looks like he has like a big meal. Uh -huh. They ain't good, but he looks really sad. Okay, he looks very sad. Now he looks like Voldemort. Maybe this is Azkaban. Dude, I didn't even <laughs> think about that. Is that Draco Malfoy? <laughs> okay, he has a really nice meal. Wait, he also has like shrimp or like yeah, worms? I don't, I don't know what if that those? is worms. It's either shrimp, which would make him rich, or worms, which would make him poor. Uh-huh. Okay, the other guy, this guy has a normal meal, but he's got some blink. He's, he's also incredibly buff. He's jacked. I don't know how that happens. You should try and hit this pose, Adam. Do well, it. I don't want to like flex on our audience. You have done that many times before. Oh, okay, I'll do it. Yeah, do it. Yeah, get this. I'm up. not even flexing right now. Oh, really? Yeah. Dude, I couldn't even see a difference. What, you want to see me flex? Oh, please, no. Is it even going to like be able to get it all in the camera? <laughs> yeah, we might need to actually zoom out on the camera. Okay, you ready? Three, two, one. <laughs> <laughs> it's funny because that's actually me flexing between these two guys already who do you think has more money i mean i think it's him because he's got the bling <laughs> he apparently has money for like a personal trainer yeah in jail. yeah i mean he's rich okay the third guy he's looking at the muscular dude uh-huh it looks like he has a bottle of some undisclosed drink it might be like mountain dew yeah this is tough man i mean i don't know they all look rich for different reasons this guy got a really nice meal this mm -hmm. guy got the best meal this guy's jacked and he has bling and this guy has this bottle which i don't understand but Dude, it might be soda like do they allow soda in jail okay i'm thinking it's either b or c but i'm thinking it's c because this bottle like he probably paid to have that like snuck in jail you know like that's not safe like you can't have that bottle he could like use it to like break something you oh, know yeah okay wait let me try and help you solve the riddle huh i'll be all three of these guys and maybe it'll help you figure out who's rich okay okay first i'll be guy a okay okay so he's bald <laughs> okay wait 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 if you are gonna be the prisoner we must have some security guard master Mr. Kookie has come in. He says, don't move. Yeah. He says, we are now handcuffed together. Don't make any sudden moves. Person A has a big meal. So I got some donuts, some Oreos, yeah. all the good stuff, right? Yeah, yeah. But he's really sad. So he's eating like this. But I was supposed to be helping you solve the riddle. <laughs> Cookie says, I have confiscated your food. And now, I am now locking you up and confiscating your food. Yeah. But I'm not done trying to help you solve the riddle. Yeah. Okay, cool. We got a food party. Yeah. So now. <laughs> no. So now. No, not so now. now Justin. Now, Cookie and Justin. I have all the food. No, Justin. You're a little bald man <laughs> into a chair. I'm trying to help you solve this riddle. But you immediately. Immediately just took everything I had and left me with nothing. Googie says that's not true. We're gonna give you some rations. There's one fruit loop for you. That's my dinner. Yeah. You will now watch us eat these Oreos. Can I have another fruit loop? No. <laughs> Can I have that? <laughs> just that. After all that, who do you think is rich? It's honestly got to do with the drink. Because food, you could have food in jail. But to have like a special drink, he must have paid for that with money. He must have snuck that in. Cookie, I just asked. Officer Cookie says that's not allowed. He says you can have bling in jail, I think. I don't really know. You can have like gold jewelry in jail? Probably. I don't know why not. So you think the richest guy is C because he has like a special soda or something that they're not allowed in jail? Mm -hmm. Okay, let's see what the answer is. The answer is who is rich? Person oh! C, because these are not allowed in the prison. He must be rich. Let's go. Dude, you're able to figure it out. Okay, Justin got that one right, and we're gonna go to the next riddle right now, which is this poison riddle. Oh no. Okay, now a couple has just had a meal. Okay, cool, cool. Okay, it looks like a happy couple, yeah, they look right? Very happy. Anna offered her husband an apple, but he refused. No. Then she cut the apple into two. So both ate half of it. Both ate half of it? Yeah, okay, they both they had half the half. apple. As soon as he ate it, he died. He slumped over. <laughs> he took one bite. He said, okay. Yep, that's what happened. Put a, ooh, put a Roblox <laughs> out. He just faced forward. 
<laughs> Put the windows rebooting sound. <laughs> as soon as he ate it, he knocked out. How did she survive? Well, what? Okay, so that's a riddle. So <laughs> she offered him an apple. He said no. She cut the apple in half. He ate his half and he knocked out. How did that happen? Because she ate her half too. Cool. Okay, so I'm gonna bring in an apple okay. and a knife for you. Okay, let me back this up. A couple just had a meal now. I'm analyzing very closely the meal. Uh-huh. She offered him an apple, but he refused. So she cut it into two and both ate half of it. As soon as he ate it, he died. Okay, let me try it. Let me do a simulation. Okay. Adam, would you like an apple? Uh, no. Okay, well then I'm gonna cut it in half. Wow, you're really strong. Oh, oh a little bit mushy on the inside. <laughs> Just like me. <laughs> <laughs> Just like the inside of my skull. You can eat half. I'm gonna eat half. This apple Yo. went bad about three months ago. <laughs> eat it, Adam. Eat it. It's like Squidward eating the Krabby Patty. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it takes just a little bite. Eat it. Oh. <laughs> okay. Adam has passed out. Which means only one thing. Oh, no, no. I'm thinking he had an apple allergy. <laughs> Boom, bop. <laughs> what is so funny? <laughs> if he had an apple allergy, why would he eat an apple? This is a riddle episode. None of this makes sense. It's either an apple allergy or, Adam, you gave away the answer. How? You called it a poison riddle. Oh. Why didn't you just call it an apple riddle? So there is poison involved, but they both ate the apple. I know. He probably ate the apple seeds. And apple seeds are poisonous. And she didn't. Wait, apple seeds are poisonous? Yeah. Is it because when you eat an apple seed, the tree grows inside you? Okay, let's see what the actual answer is. The poison was on one edge of the knife. When she cut the apple, only half of it was poison. So when she cut it, look, the poison went on one side, not her side. <laughs> and oh my God. <laughs> So Justin got that one wrong. Now we're gonna move on to the next riddle, which is this SpongeBob riddle. What? Okay, now all you gotta tell me is whose pet is it? We have Sandy, Patrick, and Squidward. Yeah. And then in the middle is someone's pet. At first glance, I thought that might be SpongeBob in disguise. It is not. <laughs> now it's a bird, it might have to live on land, so I'm thinking it might live with Sandy Cheeks. Okay. okay. I don't think it lives with Patrick, because Patrick lives under a rock. And it would not be able to fly under a rock. Okay, that's very true. And I don't think it lives with Squidward because Squidward doesn't like things in general. Mm -hmm. I don't think he'd want to take care of it. Wait! It has matching trunks with Patrick. Dude! Is it Patrick's? I'm gonna say it's Patrick because they have the same shorts. What? To double check, I'm gonna eat this delicious Krabby Patty. It's gonna increase my IQ. Okay. <laughs> Why is so funny? Wait, what do you think the answer is now? Is this how you did so well on the SAT? <laughs> <laughs> what was your score on the SAT? Very high. <laughs> what does SAT stand for? SAT. SAT. Sad. As in, you about to get sad on. <laughs> what was your score on the SAT? Yeah, real high. Really? <laughs> I filled out every bubble. <laughs> yeah. I filled out every bubble. Wait, like the multiple choice? You just filled in every bubble? <laughs> no, guys, don't do that. Don't do that. That's a joke. Don't do that in real life. You will not pass. Okay, so whose pet do you think it is? So, before you ate the burger, you thought it was Patrick because they have the same color of shorts. Yeah. After you ate the burger, what do you think the answer is now? Now that your IQ is higher and leaned through all that work. I'm thinking it's still Patrick. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Doesn't get a lock in Patrick's star as who the owner of the pet is? Mm -hmm. The answer is Patrick! Because they have the same shorts! Let's go! Dude, okay, let us know if you were able to figure that riddle out as well as Justin. Justin got that one right and we get on to the next riddle right now, which is who is richer? Okay, who's richer? Okay, so there's two guys. You have to tell me which one of the two guys has more money. Okay, so the guy on the left is literally burning dollar bills. He's throwing them into a fire. <laughs> the guy on the right is shopping. Uh huh. He's got some clothes that say sale on them. Okay, so he's buying stuff that's on sale. Yeah, and he's in a Prada 
crystal one. I think what the riddle wants me to think is that it's the guy who's looking at the sale. Uh huh. You know, I think that's what they want. And it's like, oh, you know, obviously, you know, obviously this guy's richer because he's got so much money. Right. What if it's a decoy and these are not real dollar bills? Like a fake flex. A fake flex. Like he bought like fake money and then he goes in public and like rumples up the money and throws it away to look really cool. <laughs> but it's actually fake money. I don't really know, honestly. This I mean, guy looks really sad though. This guy looks just straight up depressed. Do you think that's part of it? Like he has so much money that he wants to like burn it because he just wants to get rid of it because it made him so depressed? Wait, you're actually a genius. What if it's not richer like materialistic things? What if it's richer like spiritual? Like happiness? Yeah, this guy looks real happy. Look, he's like, I found a nice deal. This guy is depressed. Money cannot buy happiness. So when you get really sad, do you throw money into the fire? Well, when I get really sad, I throw food into my mouth. <laughs> but that's kind of similar. You do that when you're not sad too though. Oh, yeah. <laughs> no, yeah. Can you demonstrate what you look like when you're sad? Oh, yeah, definitely. Okay, it's your girlfriend. She just broke up with you. <laughs> I'm gonna take my justy bucks uh -huh. and throw them into a fire. Uh huh. And then I'm gonna take some honey bucks and I'm gonna throw them into my mouth. Does this make you feel better? <laughs> I don't need to call my girlfriend, honey, because I got some honey bun. <laughs> yeah. I think the guy on the left is richer unless these bills are fake and he's got play money and he's doing a fake flex, you know? Like Monopoly money? Yeah, like he's trying to flex on the gram or uh -huh. for TikTok. Okay. Yeah, it's got to be him. Okay, Justin thinks it's A because he's throwing money in the fire. I mean, unless it's play money. The answer is B because it's on sale, but it's Prada. The store he was at is Prada, so if he's shopping there, he has has to be rich. <laughs> but the other guy's throwing money into a fire. I hate these riddles, Adam. Justin got that one wrong. <laughs> Let us know if you guys were able to figure that out. Okay, Justin got three out of the five riddles correct, which is over half, which means you won. <laughs> <laughs>